guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Shania and boy do I have something for y'all Cajun style red beans and rice like this was so good this is the type of meal that stick to your bones go ahead and stay tuned for the full recipe getting started go ahead and add one tablespoon of olive oil to the pan and get it nice and hot and you want to brown your andouille sausages I'm using two packs and I wanted a lot of meat and I know me while I'm cooking I'm gonna eat so I'll be taking little bites here and there so I had to make sure that I made enough and once you get them nice and brown go ahead and take them out and set them to the side for later use Don't wash your pan. Go ahead and leave the oil in there and we're going to go ahead and add in our vegetables. And we're going to saute them until they're nice and soft. We have some bell peppers, onion, and celery. And get that mixed well and cook until they're nice and soft. Add a tablespoon of minced garlic in and go ahead and get that mixed up and let this cook for about two minutes. Don't cook it on high because you don't want to burn your garlic. And of course we want to add some mo flavor in there so let's go ahead and add in one tablespoon of smoked paprika one teaspoon of seasoning salt a tablespoon of garlic and herb blend and one tablespoon of oregano and mix that well until it's well incorporated at this point the kitchen is starting to smell good because you know them flavors are bouncing off the walls okay you know you should soak your beans overnight in water but if you don't you can do what I did and boil some water and once it comes to a boil turn it off and then add your beans in and cover it for an hour and that'll be the same as if you were to soak it overnight so once your beans are added in go ahead and cover them with water I ended up using about six cups of water and one thing I always forget to film is me adding my bay leaves in so don't forget to add that in as well once you get all your water in, you want to put the cover on it and let it cook for at least two to three hours. Now, beans take forever, okay? So don't do this when you're hungry because you're going to be mad. Check on it occasionally, but not too much because you know the more you check, the less it cooks. So I'm just checking on it halfway through, making sure nothing's sticking and stuff like that. And as you can see, there's still plenty of water in there. You want to wait until most of the water is out. And as you can see, I'm just taking my ladle and I'm smashing them up. And this is an important step because this is how you get that texture you're looking for when you're eating red beans and rice. Once you get it mashed up, go ahead and add it back in along with your sausages. I didn't do it on screen because I actually forgot about it for a while. But y'all know. If y'all like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any questions or comments. And don't forget to subscribe and smash that bell if you haven't done so. So y'all never miss another video.